Hey, I'm Justin, and you're about to watch one of the most comprehensive mobile electronics repair guides on the internet. So sit back, relax, and get ready to learn, because this is The Art of Repair. On today's episode of The Art of Repair, we continue our mini-series on the 5-in-1 TBK518 refurbishing machine. Last time we went over the frame separation plates on the side of the machine, today we'll be talking to you about the frame lamination and delamination plates on the inside portion of the machine. Since both processes are identical, we will be killing two birds with one stone today and talking about both functions at once. This way we can move through these basics and get through the good stuff at least one week faster. Up to this point, we have really only gone over Samsung display information, but this machine is just as capable of getting meaningful iPhone work done as well. The purpose of these lamination plates is to heat up and evenly laminate the HMG glue frames to the glass. Being able to do this properly will give you an edge on high copy displays for sure. If you take the time to do this manually and correctly, you will not regret it. There is just something about doing it manually over an auto machine or purchasing low quality, unverifiable CBG frames. Using this machine in my own extra steps, I have never had a single one come back to me lifted. But this also comes with the extra steps in your check-in process to eliminate bent frame devices. Be aware. If a frame on a device is bent, it's possible to even have separation on an OEM Apple display. What's really cool about this machine is that you can use it to delaminate as well, but not on everything. Generally, it only works well with 5 series displays, since they use a weaker form of adhesive than the 6 series and newer. Anything newer than a 5 series has a delamination process all of its own. I will now demonstrate both a 5 series frame lamination and delamination. If you're interested in learning more about the ins, outs, and all the finer points in between concerning display refurbishing, including my secret tips on getting the strongest HMG bond and all other aspects of mobile electronics repair, go ahead and subscribe for weekly videos. For those already subscribed, stay tuned as we continue to cover the features of the TBK 5-in-1 refurbishing machine, including a teardown of the machine and a repair guide. After we finish with the TBK 518, we will continue to talk about the rest of the machines I use daily to refurbish displays. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comments are always welcome down below. Remember, it's all about building fundamental knowledge, then skill. So once again, I'm Justin, and this is The Art of Repair. See ya!